Hello everyone, welcome again to another video to the Fox Tech on the Fox Tech YouTube channel. This time we talk about the Apple Music. The topic is what happens when you delete the Apple Music app on your iPhone. And now let me just show it to you right now what happens. Like if you delete that, you get a couple of options. So you can at first remove the app from the home screen. It means that you just remove it from the main screen, but it's still going to be accessible when I click on that. Uh, you can see that it disappears, but I can still find it inside in here inside of the app library. But if I want to, I can just delete the app and purchase and synced music on this device will be deleted. So when I click on that, the app is going to be removed. But I get this very interesting pop up since I have Apple Music subscription. And in case you don't have it, in case you don't pay monthly for Apple Music, you're not going to get this pop up. But in my case, I do. And it gives me the option to either keep the subscription that means that let's say i have different iphones where i use the apple music when i just turn on keep or select keep i'll be able to use it on different devices but if not i can manage it inside of the settings so that's an option as well the little pop-up also tells me that i'm paying for the music apple music until the november 28th i have it paid so even if i cancel it that means that until the November 28th, I will be, still be able to use Apple Music normally. But if you want to manage it, click on Manage Subscriptions. And it shows you this little splash screen or this little pop-up shows up. You can see, for me, Apple Music Family, I pay this amount of money the, on the 20th of each month. So that's okay. And I can cancel the subscription by clicking on the Cancel button, which is the red one at the bottom. Or I can switch to a different plan. So like this, I can switch to an individual family on all the stuff. So that's just basically what happens. Now, I don't really have the music app anymore. I just clicked on manage the subscription, but I didn't change anything. It's still working normally, but I just don't have the app icon, which you can always get from the app store. You just look up music. I believe the first one should be the Apple Music. You just download it. It's going to be pretty quick so you can get it inside. This is the Apple Music. And once it loads up, once it just gets downloaded, you can, you can get inside. And since you are logged in with the same Apple ID, I didn't log out or didn't sign out of my Apple ID, I can still access the very same music library. Nothing is really going on. Yeah, you can see some new stuff. All of that is being added, but you can see my library is loading from the cloud. And the same stuff is simply is going to be re-added back again to my library. So the same songs which I had before, basically nothing changed. Since I use Apple Music, all of this stuff is just going to become here available as well. The downloaded stuff, like the songs which I saved for a download for offline usage, are not going to be there. I'm going to have to re-download it. And also, if I downloaded any songs, like purchase them one by one from the iTunes, not from Apple Music, but let's say that I just bought like one song for, for a dollar, let's say this was the case, in this scenario, these songs are not going to be here as well. They're just going to be disappearing. It's just not going to be part of the Apple Music app since I deleted, but I can still get it inside uh, the, in case you purchase songs for, you know, like you can buy songs for a dollar or an album for 10 bucks. In case you did that, you can still go inside the iTunes store, click on more options, click on purchased, and you're going to be able to see them here. I do not have anything inside of the music section. But in case you do, you can re-download it back again to the Apple Music uh, library or to the Apple Music app. So I don't have anything in here, but in case I did, this is what I would have to do after re-downloading the music app. But I'm gonna wrap up the video right now. I hope you found it useful. That's basically all the stuff that you need to know about it. So yeah, but before I need to show you one thing which I've been working on. You can see it right here. It is the Fox Tech educational platform. It is free to join. Link is down below in the description. Go ahead and check it out right now because because uh, there are some other people learning already inside. And also there are free resources like um, free video editing course, in-depth guides for iPhone apps. Definitely go ahead and join it right now and I'll see you inside. Thanks a lot for watching. Now subscribe to Fox Tech as well and I'll see you in the next future video.